Hey guys, uh, it is Friday, uh, March the 20th, and uh, just wanted to to check in with you guys. Um, I had a uh, had a few sales. I'm actually gonna uh, get those packaged up, um, and then I want to tell you guys about. Um, excuse the mess. I've been photographing shoes. Some things I'm listening to today. I got some cool Sperry's top sliders and Tiva hiking sandals, and then a book set. And um, I photographed a uh, Pendleton shirt, and then a ton of T-shirts. So <clears throat> those are all photographed and. At some point today, um, I'll measure those and get everything started. But um, let me tell you guys about my my sales. Um, first one, I have, I think I have like six of these. I picked them up at a um, discount store for like $2 a piece. And it's the official Guitar Heroes um, Maplewood faceplate for the uh, guitar controller. Um, I've had them up for a while and I thought they'd be a quick flip. They're video game related. Guitar Hero is a popular game, uh, but they've been sitting for a while. Uh, so I sold one and it sold for uh, $19.84. Um, that was, that's with taxes and shipping. I charged $8.50 shipping on that. Um, a, a Star Trek The Experience t-shirt that sold for uh, $32.53 uh, buyer paid shipping and then a uh, the enchanted world wizards and witches uh, book a vintage uh, an old vintage book that was part of like one of those old like time life uh, type of sets uh, that Sorry, I'm glancing at my computer. Uh, that sold for $16.20, and it's going uh, free shipping, media mail. I don't charge for media mail. Um, maybe I should. But media mail is pretty cheap. So those are the three things that I sold overnight. Um, hopefully, I will sell more. So <clears throat> another thing I want to tell you guys is... Uh, Cricket hasn't been feeling well again. Uh, he had been my buddy. He had been uh, throwing up last night, and today he was he threw up some blood. So I don't know if just the throwing up irritated his throat or what happened. But normally he is he likes his wet food, but. He, He's not eating it. So, um, we've got a, a vet appointment at, um, <clears throat> he's got an itch. We got a vet appointment at, uh, at four and, um, they're gonna check them out. They do have COVID-19, um, procedures in place. So, uh, they'll actually have to, uh, that's my death pile part of it anyway <laughs> um they'll uh take him we'll have to remain in the car and they're gonna take him in and consult us by phone on everything so that should be an interesting thing but yeah if you would give us some good thoughts for Bubba and um I'll update you guys a little later today Okay guys, uh, we are at the vet's office. I'm parked in an assigned parking space. I'll flip the camera around so you guys can see, but basically I drove up, they stayed six feet away and kind of yelled at me. <laughs> um, well, they didn't yell at me. They uh, loudly spoke to me and got the information and then they um, directed me to a parking space. Um, so they're supposed to call me shortly. And then the tech is gonna come get Cricket out of the car. Um, he's been pretty good, he's been hanging out. He was mad when I put him in there, in the crate, but um, 
he's uh, he's just been chilling. So, um, so yeah, so that is the update for for now. Let me uh, I'll flip the camera around and I'll I'll show you guys the reception area from here. All right. <laughs> So you see that blue, um, that blue thing, that's the reception area there. Normally, of course, you can just walk into the lobby and check it in, but that is what's happening. So, oh, sorry guys. Let me say hello to Cricket. Hey buddy. How are you feeling, huh? You doing okay? Bubba. It's okay. It's okay. Alright guys. I'll check in after everything's done. Alright. Uh, it's almost two hours later and uh, Cricket is back. He's uh, hanging out in the, the crate. Uh, basically, they did, uh, they did blood work. They did a panel on him. Um, they uh, gave him a... Uh, sorry, I was reading the paperwork. They gave him a shot for the nausea and then um, some selenium? No something else. Some other medication. Um, they think he might have a, maybe an ulcer. Um, then they also sent him home with um, some uh, some dry and wet food, some um, special digestive um, food for him. So we're gonna have to we're gonna have to feed him separately. We're going to have to figure that out because the other two um, they eat all the same food. So but anyway, so um, I did I did film a little bit them bringing out um, some dogs uh, some patients um, from the building out to the cars to people just so you guys can kind of see what kind of safety uh, precautions they're, they're taking uh, here at this vet. Um I'm sure other vets are probably doing similar things, but yeah, they just basically are masked and gloved up and they're, um, you stay in your car and, uh, they come and get the animal and then they return the animal to your car and just kind of hang out. Um, so yeah, so they said, hopefully this works. If not, um, he might need x-rays, but hopefully not. So... <laughs> That has been my day. Uh, I'm going to end the vlog here. Uh, I'm going to give you some more shots of, of Cricket's cute face at the end. Uh, but if, uh, if you would please like this video, uh, comment or questions down below as always. And if you're not subscribed, please make sure you're subscribed and hit that bell so you get alerts. And uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Oh, are you mad? <laughs> I know. Okay, we'll go home now. I love you. Okay.